Are you struggling to generate a PDF with non-ASCII characters in Python? You're not alone. Many developers face this issue, and today we're gonna solve it together. I totally get it. It can be incredibly frustrating when your code seems right, but the output is just not what you expect. This is a common hurdle for many Python users. Here's the specific question we're addressing today. One user asked, how can I generate a PDF with non-ASCII characters using Python 3.5.2, Python PDF Kit, and WKHTML Talks 0.12.2? They provided a simple example, but the output was incorrect. Let's dive into this and find a solution. So what's going wrong here? The issue often lies in how non-ASCII characters are handled in HTML and how PDF Kit processes that content. We'll break it down step by step and stick around. I have a crucial tip at the end that will help you avoid this issue in the future. To generate a PDF with non-ASCII characters, the user should first ensure that the HTML content is properly encoded. This means using Unicode for the non-ASCII characters. Next, the user should specify the configuration options for PDF kit. This includes setting the encoding to UTF-8, which is essential for handling non-ASCII characters. Now the user can call the fromString method with the HTML content and the output file name, while including the options for encoding. Finally, the user should check the output PDF to ensure that the non-ASCII characters are displayed correctly. If everything is set up properly, the character should appear as expected. Fun fact! The character O is known as an umlaut and is used in several languages, including German. It's fascinating how a little character can cause big problems in coding. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative solution suggests that to generate a PDF with non-ASCII characters, you need to use an embedded font. The built-in fonts have a limited character set, which can cause issues with displaying certain characters. Additionally, there is a helpful resource that provides guidance on how to output special characters, like the Euro symbol in PDF Kit for Node.js. This can give you clues on how to handle non-ASCII characters in your PDF generation. Now, let's see a response from a different user. An alternative solution suggests setting the char set in the options when generating the PDF. This way, you won't need to modify the HTML file which is especially useful if you're not the one creating it. Here's that crucial tip I promised. Always ensure your HTML content is properly encoded before passing it to PDF Kit. This simple step can save you a lot of headaches. And there you have it. You should now be able to generate PDFs with non-ASCII characters without any issues. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe for more tips and tricks.